Hello, my name is Edward Reed, and this is episode four of Strictly Confidential for a Little Less Strictly Come Dancing. Tonight, I am joined with Kerry Montgomery and David Morrison. Hello, beautiful people. How are you? Good, thank you. Thank How are you? Yeah, very Good. well, thanks. David, you're looking a bit starstruck, not with me, but the whole Strictly experience. How are you finding it? Um, quite, quite the, not what I expected. So from start to where I am just now, um, a lot of hard work. Thanks to Kerry, um, and she's taking me on a journey, but it's been been great fun along the way. Brilliant, right, so we're hearing that from a lot of contestants, right? Kerry, what is it really like? I would agree, a big journey um, from the guy that walked in the first day thinking, right, it'll be tricky, but it'll be it'll be all right to yeah, get into where we go. Mm. It's been, there's been lots of ups and downs, but yeah, no, we're getting there. You said earlier on to me off camera that you like a challenge, you like to do things, and this is completely out of your comfort zone. As I as I'd mentioned, you know, um, and and people do amazing jobs, but a marathon's not for me, no. um, unless I'm eating it. Uh, <laughs> but something like this, uh, you know, you're learning something new, it's something different. Um, it's quite scary, but I think uh, as as a lot of people have said, you know, the outcome will be very rewarding as well as doing something for a a, a great charity. So, Kerry, what is what's happening on the night? What you've given us, without giving too much away. Um, we are doing an upbeat track uh -huh. and style of dance. Um, so if nothing else, on the night it will be it will lift the room and everyone will, will love the song. Oh, brilliant! We've actually got a wee clip which we're going to show you right now. Have a look. That was absolutely fantastic. Uh, David, I don't know what you were talking about. You look, the two you look as if you're having a great time there. You're laughing, you're, there's carry on. You even get up to the cabin and give a thumbs up. You're totally confident, what are you talking about? <laughs> yeah, there was no one else in the room bar Kerry and me. That's, that's absolutely fine. <laughs> so you're going, to, you're going to do that, because you were saying about fundraising. Have you got fundraising coming up? What are you doing? Yeah, so we have a race night coming up. Um, next next week and we're doing that uh, jointly with another contestant so oh, uh, again just trying to get the um, as many people as we can involved prizes gifts donations anything that we can do to to raise awareness and and have a bit of practice practice you practice, practice. You dance on the night yes a good that's good. the whole point of it it oh, is about yeah. the fundraising but a huge part mm. of it is practicing with an audience no you need that that's great i'm glad you're doing that because you, you'll you'll love it and then when it comes to the big night itself what about costume talk us through it Mm, can't give too much away, okay, I don't okay, think. Yeah. Do do All I'll say is we're, we're sticking with the kind of 1920s theme of the night mm, for nice. our costumes. There might be... Twangers? Or some <laughs> twangers? Some props. Some oh props. to the twangers. <laughs> <laughs> Just hope you don't take any diet with your twanger, David. Yeah, well... <laughs> <laughs> um, so, David, um, how are you feeling about the big night, the dance, the show? Um, really nervous about it um the biggest thing the biggest fear that i've got about it is is actually not performing a dance i think that's fine and it'll be great fun throughout it is i don't want to let kerry down you know the, the amount of effort she's and, nodding she's and, like and, you and, better, no, 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 the amount of training that she's in <laughs> time that she's put in invested into me to get me to where i am today uh, i just want to make her proud as well oh, um, at the at the end of the night that i don't get a throat punch <laughs> yeah, I'll try hard not to do that, but you, yeah. you'll be fine. I it, could you just will. see the Sunday meal the next day. <laughs> <laughs> Hospital throat punch incident. Yeah. <laughs> so thank you so much again, Kerry. You support every year and the hospice just is so grateful and they love you for it. And David, doing this completely out of your comfort zone. Um, and I know you, you need to trust your friends and family are going to be so proud of you. Um, and the hospice is so grateful for all you're doing for it. If you want to support David and Kerry, which I know you do, just look at the details underneath this video here and support this amazing charity. Thank you. Mm -hmm.